Fatty, you're here in Central Love, sleeping rough. Yes. Tell me about it. Just, <clears throat> I've just been around back and forth here you now for the last 10 years. You know, trying to get a place here, trying to get to a hostel. I can't get a hostel because they're not connected to you, so they say. But um, yeah, you know, I was down in Wales, I was coming from Wales this morning. Just to try to sort me, I don't like, you know, try to bump the cooks and Christians. I used to know Jesus Army up in Northampton. Sometimes you come to London, you know. So I was hoping I'd see them, I can catch up, catch with them and, you know, just trying to sort me, I don't like, you know. So you can't get into a hostel because you're not from here? I'm not from here, no. So what bring, keeps bringing you back to central London? I don't know, just, it's different, isn't it? I've been to Manchester, I've been all, I've been all over the country, you know. But this London, it just draws me back here, you know. You know, it's not safe for really to sleep up around here at night, you know, it's a bit dangerous, like, you know. But, um, yeah, I've, I've, had a, I've had a, you know, upbringing, like, you know. I was in hospital for years with the burns, you know. Yeah, you were showing me your... Oh, my gosh. On my back, sir. Oh, I see. Oh, my gosh. And, um, you yeah, said a gas stove? Gas cooker, yeah, blow me up, chuck me out for the, out, outside the street for the window, like, and straight out. Oh, so you're sleeping rough when that happened? Yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. what happened after that? And um, I was in hospital for three years, and I went into to a, a place, and um, they looked after me for a while, until I got back on my feet. Like nine months, 12 months, you know, in, um, in a special unit. And um, I come out with it, and I went straight back on the streets. You know, I've, been waiting, I've been waiting, like, in Wales now for like 15 years to get a flat. And I'm still waiting, you know, it's, it's a waiting game, you know? Well, I can I just go through a lot of things at the moment, you know what I mean? Trying to be out, you know, as a Christian, like, you know what I mean? Trying to shut my head out and, you know, I've got people down there that I love down in Wales, but it's not working out, like, you know, it's just, it's just London Bill draws me back a bit, like, you know? But I wish I'd never come here now, tell you, I got caught on the train. <laughs> so what's a day like? What's a day like sleeping rough? Oh, it's hard, it's getting hard and hard, and it's getting hard and hard. I, like, I, last time I was here, two months ago, three months ago, I didn't have no sleeping bags or nothing for, for you know, for months. And I was, that was, you know, sleeping rough up, up the top there. Eh? And the doorway up there, and then um, just cardboard. No blankets, no sleep bags, you wouldn't give no sleep bags, nothing on there, you know. I know they do a lot, and they do good to everyone on there, you know, they do do good. They almost shut the team on there, they do, you know, they do try to do the best they can, you know, but it, it is getting hard and harder to sleep you know, and, you know, it's getting dangerous, that's all it is. With all the junkies and all them, you know. So what's your future like? I don't know, mate. I really, I really can't say, you know. I'm hoping something turns right for me, you know, because I need, I need it. I feel like I'm having a nervous breakdown now, you know. Just bubbling around, doing what I'm doing, you know. I just, it's nice to have a friend, you know. I, I don't know anyone here, and I, I'll just curl up somewhere and I'll find somewhere in the minute and just curl up there and just get my done. Well, you know me and I'm going to be around for a week or so, man. Yeah. Um, if you had three wishes, what would what would they be? One to have a place. Yeah, one to have a place. Two to get on with God more. And three just to, just to go straight, just to be straight. Go straight for the change, you know. I've done all the drug scene, I've done all that, I've done, I've done all the business. I've done anything like, you know. I'm 55 now, you know, and I've, 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 I've gone through enough like, you know. I think it's time. Well, thank you very much for talking to me. It's all right, you're welcome, guys. You're welcome.